friction. Friction is a force opposing motion. It always acts in the opposite directions of motion. For example, if a car moves to the right, the friction will act to the left. When the car moves to the left, the friction acts to the right. Friction acting on a moving object. The friction acts on a moving object is always constant. For example, when the forward thrust of 200 newton acting on a moving car, the friction is 200 newton. When the forward thrust is increased to 300 newton, the friction is still 200 newton. When the forward thrust increases to 400 newton, the friction will remain at 200 newton. The magnitude of friction will not change according to the forward force. Example 3. A car of mass 500 kg moves at a constant velocity when a forward thrust of 600 newtons acts on it. Find the friction axis on the car. Find the acceleration of the car when the forward thrust is increased to 700 newton. Let's solve question A first. Let's say we have a car. There are two forces acting on the car, the friction and the forward thrust. The forward thrust is 600 newton. The car is moving at a constant velocity. According to Newton's first law, if an object is stationary or move at constant velocity, the forces acting on it must be in equilibrium. If the forces are in equilibrium, the force acting backward must equal to the force acting forward. Therefore, the friction must be equal to the forward thrust which is 600 newton. For B, the forward thrust is increased to 700 newton, and we are asked to find the acceleration. From Newton's second law, we know that the acceleration can be determined by using the equation F equal to MA. Well, from my experience, most students will make mistake at this step. They will straight away take the 700 newton as the force F. Now. Every time when you want to use the equation F equal to MA, keep in mind that the F is the net force acting on the object. Net force is the sum of all forces. The forward thrust is 700 newton, and there is a 600 newton friction which is acting backward. We get this 600 newton from question A. Friction will not change according to the forward force. Therefore, the net force is 700 newton minus 600 newton. The mass is 500 kg. Solve the equation A is equal to 0 0.2 meter per second square.